Yes, people, it's myself, Lippy. I'm inside with the MO girls today. I've got the weapon mic with me. <laughs> so you know it's serious. <laughs> what does MO stand for, girls, first of all? Well, it stands for, it's Latin for mode of operation. Mode of operation. And it means a particular way of doing something to achieve your goals or dreams. Okay, then. So we have Annie, Nadine, and Chanel. Sorry to point the, the rod at you like this. Oh, I, I feel like I'm getting told off. I can't help myself. <laughs> you might recognise them from their banger last year, Bad Vibes, featuring Mr. Easy and the Lotto Boys. They also have a tune out right now called Choose Sides with AJ Tracy. It's a very nice tune again, I must Thank say. Thank you. So who influences you, like, music-wise? If you have any influences. It might not even be a musician. What What is your influence? We love R&B. That's what we grew up listening to. Um, R&B pop, we always sort of say. Afrobeat. Music comes naturally to us, like we write and everything, so we're just doing what we enjoy. What genre would you say you lot actually are? R&B pop. R&B so, pop, yeah. yeah. 100%. Definitely. So the Bad Vibes <coughs> tune, big, big tune, come out early 2018. Definitely put you lot on the map. Mm -hmm. But for me, that's kind of like an Afro swing kind of vibe. Where did that come from? We were in the studio with a, a writer called Dayo who does a lot of Afro beat stuff and we work with her a lot yeah. and she had a part of the song already done and we heard the chorus and it was just so sick. We loved it straight away, didn't we? Loved we? it. So yeah, we got in the studio, tune, put some of our own bits on it. It was um, produced yeah. by a guy called Grades, super talented and yeah. then obviously we wanted uh, Lotto Boys on it and Mr Easy and when, when they both heard it, they, they all loved it as much as we did. Yeah. The first thing that came out of Ash's mouth was the first thing that went on the record. Mm. Actually, Mr Easy heard it and wanted to go on it. Well, I heard it, I, I wanted to go on there. Yeah. Oh yeah, it was Lucky. him, it was yeah. him first, wasn't yeah. it? And then... It's been long lasting, I think a lot of UK music, people kind of think, yeah, this is a banger. They kind of just get rid of it in a couple of months, but it's over 18 months now, so... Doing all right, yeah. isn't it? Serious. Well, platinum. Serious tune. <laughs> You've also done collabs with Chipmunk. You got some heavy collaboration so far for the time that you lot been around. But is there anyone that you'd want to collab with that you haven't let? UK or anyone? UK, I'd probably say J Hus. J Hus. Mm. Yeah. Obviously, Drake that. has always said this all the time. Yeah. But you know, recently, yeah, I know it sounds weird, but I've kind of wanted to do something with Ed Sheeran. Oh. I don't know. I feel like he's hella versatile. Oh. Like. No, he definitely yeah. is. And it could be mad interesting. Ooh, Maybe yeah. him and like a rapper. That would be... I love his new one. If you ever... What was that? Then you asked me. His oh, brand new one. With Chance the Rapper. Ooh. Oh! Oh! Chance the Rapper, big inspiration of mine. Speaking of your inspirations and that, who who do you listen to at the moment? UK-wise, um, US? Heady one. Heady one. I like, listen to him as well, you know. I wouldn't have expected that from you, though, Chanel. Why? Cause you're you're Chanel. You're, what do you mean? You're in the... He's one of my inspirations as well. Oh wow! Everyone, Erica Badu, Chance the Rapper, uh, Taurus Wiley. Ross, that's four very different. Yeah, mad different isn't artists. It? That's yeah. so. We're gonna play a little bit of Snog Marry Avoid right now. You know the rules to that game. Yep. I want complete honesty. I don't care Always about honest. who's gonna be upset out there. You have to let them know. <laughs> so the free people we're going to use it's going to be Anthony Joshua mm -hmm. your mate AJ Tracy mm -hmm. and Ed Sheeran oh. Ed Sheeran <laughs> so who you snogging who you marrying who you avoiding let's let Annie go first um okay who was the middle one it's Anthony it's Joshua Ed Sheeran AJ Tracy okay cool so I'm going to Avoid Anthony Joshua. Oh. Um, Why? Do you know what it is for me? There's no denying that that guy is, is so good looking. He's, you know, got so much going for him. But you know when just everyone fancies someone? I hate him for that too. So <laughs> You're like really good looking light skinned guys with the green eyes. Don't do it for me. I like someone that looks a bit too, rough. too commercial for Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like someone a little bit rough. For no Has Anthony Joshua got green eyes? He green no, eyes. he yeah. doesn't, yeah. but... So I'll avoid him for them reasons. Nothing too bad. Obviously, they're good reasons, really, why I've avoided him. But it just doesn't do it for me. Okay, so I'd snog AJ. Yeah, you, you... Oh, I thought it was Anthony Joshua. I don't even oh, know. Oh, yeah, yeah. Anthony Joshua. So you snog, snog AJ. AJ Tracy. He's, he's, pretty, he's pretty fit. 
he did he know this when he was making the tune? He probably did it. <laughs> He's brief. Now you know, bro. Now you know. Um, and I'd marry Ed Sheeran just because I think he'd treat you really well. Uh, Ed seems like a lovely guy. Most men that play guitar, they're just they're nice people, isn't it? Yeah, he looks like he'd be a nice guy to settle yeah. down with. You know what I mean? You gotta give the gingers a chance. <laughs> <laughs> give the gingers a chance. Yeah. So I'm the same. I'm the same girl. Same. You. Same. Um, I'd marry. I'd marry Ed Sheeran because oh, I think his talent is phenomenal. Mm -hmm. um, I'd love to write some songs with him. Um, yeah, that's what I'm gonna say on that one. Yeah. I think I'd avoid um, Anthony Joshua because he hasn't got hair and I don't like that. And he's too tall. Oh. And I would snog Ed Sheeran and marry AJ because I think like we could be best friends. Me and Ed Sheeran wouldn't be best friends. Okay. Mm. Ed Sheeran's not for you. No. But he's got hair, so... He's not for... I mean, he's <laughs> definitely not my usual type, but I just think long term. Thinking ahead. Well, Ed, you got two fiancés in there. <laughs> <laughs> I brought you in. Just remember me, my bro, yeah? Out of you three, who takes the longest to get ready? quickly it's definitely not me but it's no not because she's before. like long she just likes to take her time yeah, she likes to stop. so basically yeah. i set extra time on purpose so i can get ready slowly but i'm always on time mm. so but i make long. sure i'm on time yeah but on purpose so cause i'm the sort of person that will be getting ready but then we'll stop, stop. For a bit. <laughs> and i'm the quickest to get ready <laughs> but the I'm you're always late. Yeah. Because I know I'm quick, so I'm like, I don't need to get out of bed yet. It's calm. And I then see. I do it and I'm late. <laughs> so you're speaking about marriage just before. Who will be the first to get married out of the three of you? Let's Annie. go. Yeah, 100%. Why is that? Is Anyone's that... our babies. <laughs> is that because you've got a man at the moment? or is that No, cause... I actually haven't got a boyfriend at the minute, but I don't know. I don't know why me. Wifey material, isn't it? Well, and we're not. <laughs> I don't want to be no wife, but I don't know that. And yeah, marriage isn't really everything. Kind of on the opposite side, who has the most trouble with men? Who who has relationship issues? <laughs> let let the people them know. <laughs> These two are tied. Hey, are. Oh, oh, don't okay. try okay, it. No. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait. <laughs> Yeah, I'd say they're a tie. If I had to pick, like, had to, maybe Chanel. From what I've gathered from this, you like the ruffians. You like the road kind of man, <laughs> them. Car. Even no, who did you say? Rappers, rappers in road. Rappers they're not rappers. road. Rappers, oh, rappers are just rappers. But you like, <laughs> you're like, you like a road man. Yeah. Compared to the sweet boys. And you lot compare, like, more like the sweet or more softer looking. And you kind of want the gangster. Mm. She's interesting. But then they have to be short, so they're like... They have to be short? Yeah. I don't like tall boys. It's too... I don't want to... No. <laughs> I think she's the only girl in England. Now, I was going to say that. Them. Short man, them. Hit her up. Car. That's, a new, that's a new you preference. Like be, you don't like to be taller than them, though. No, no. Mm -hmm. But, like, same height's fine. Mm -hmm. How tall are you? Uh, um, five, five. Five, yeah, something like that. Pff, i got a mate that's five, six. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm at cook you lot up and you lot can have a good time. I just don't know what it is. I think I just don't like being uh, smaller. <laughs> <laughs> quickly, quickly to wrap it up. I know this is, has nothing to do with what we've been speaking about for like the last 10 minutes, but you lot are established recording artists. Do you have any advice for any young and up and coming, not artists in general, but people that want to do the band thing? Because I think that's quite rare. Mm. Don't, in, do in, in <laughs> don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Um, no, you just have to. I think we always say you must, must start with just really believing in yourself. Because if you don't believe in yourself, no one else will. So get your vision, stick with it, believe in yourself, and just keep going, keep going. You're gonna have a lot of knockbacks, knockbacks, but you will get there. It's not an easy industry. Nope. Um, yeah, stay true. Just enjoy it as much as you can. What did I read the other day? It's quite. It's like a simple thing. It was like, wouldn't you rather give something a go that you love and fail at it rather than just settle in mm -hmm. for what you don't really want to do? I think it was anything in life. So, they have nice. been the M O girls, the U K Destiny's Child T L C. Oh, you too kind. I'm Lippy. <laughs> Lippy the U K. Denzel Washington. Yeah, yeah. Who else? Who else? Who, else? Who, else? who are you? Tell them. Who are you remind me of? Yeah, tell them. You remind me of Getz a bit. And you have beautiful <laughs> eyelashes. Now, Getz, that's my brother. So yeah. I don't even. I yeah, like that. He's got a proper eyelashes. hairline. Yeah, nice oh, smile and that. Yeah. Big up my nigga. Good teeth. Big up my nigga, Getz. Yeah. Yes. I ain't going to show them my hairline because it'll just fuck up <laughs> everything. 
MO Girls, Mixed Hate Madness, Lippy. It's a wrap. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.